Hey, what's up, everyone? My name's Cody. This is my beautiful wife, Shy. Hello. And welcome back to CNC Vapes with Cody and Shy. Um, today, we are going to do another e juice review. It's going to be a pretty simple one. Um, it's by the Smoothie or also by the Apollo Company. Um, be sure to check out our other video on them because we have two other reviews on our channel coming soon from them. But this one is on the their due timeline. I know that sounds weird saying due timeline, but it's on their due time e juice line. And they sent us two of these, one in zero milligram, one in three. She's going to be doing the zero. I'm going to be doing the three milligram. Um, this is a 60 ml bottle. And it is um, vanilla bean milkshake. And right now you can get them online on their website. ApolloEsigs.com For $21.95. Um, you can get it in zero milligrams max VG, three milligrams max VG, or six milligrams max VG for a 60 ml bottle. Like she just said, it is $21.95, but if you stay tuned to the end of this video or check out the description of this video, there will be a coupon code so you can get 15% off of your order. So we're going to get started. Yep. We both got the same thing in here, so we're both going to try it at the same time. She's got hers on her Freemax tank. Freemax Mesh Pro. I got mine on my iJoy Shogun um, Katina, Katana tank. I think they pronounce it. What did you want? 80 watts. I'm on 80 watts too, so we're going to get started. Okay, the description of this is a pure vanilla bean milkshake blended to perfection. Mm. Oh my. It's, um, I don't know if you ever went to the store and bought not vanilla ice cream, but vanilla bean. And it has this mm. little uh, black specks in it. It's kind of like, it's a spice. It tastes like some sort of spice. Mm. This gives you that, like a uh, vanilla spice kind of deal to it with a cream mess behind it. Part of my language, but hot damn, those are good. It's like the inhale is the vanilla bean, the spice to it. It's not spicy, don't get it wrong. It's just like a vanilla bean spice. And then the exhale is, is, a, cream, is a cream. Like a, like a vanilla ice cream. Yeah, almost just like a cool whip almost. It honestly almost tastes like a vanilla milkshake in my, to me. Like if you would go, for instance, to a uh, ice cream shop and tell me you want a vanilla ice Milkshake, that's what I get if it's pure good ice cream. Yeah, but it don't taste like regular vanilla. You mm -hmm. can tell it's vanilla bean. It it's got some spice to it. It does that vanilla bean spice in it. Oh, wow. That yeah, is good, it's though. a true vanilla bean milkshake, yeah. I will say it is sweet, though. It's, it's really sweet. sweet. Um, yeah. And that's not a bad thing. If you like, <laughs> if you like real sweet um, vapes, I think you'll like it. Or even if you like vanilla bean. And ice cream, you'll like it. Yeah. Um, the inhale is like I said, that spicy vanilla bean. Yeah. But the exhale is like, a, a, literally like a cream, a vanilla milkshake cream with like cool whip on it on top of it, and it's even on your mouth after you blow it out. Yeah, it's good cloud production. I will like say, the cream is in your mouth. There's an afterward. Yeah, it's almost like you ate a bowl of ice cream. Excuse me. Now I will say something about this though. Right off the bat, if you're it's looking good. for something that isn't that you do not get a flavor hit with every hit I wouldn't suggest getting this because with every drag you get and every hit you take on your vape you're going to get you're going to taste flavor um, it's really good the only thing I see about it that the I don't aftertaste is amazing though the only thing I can say that I don't like about it, and it's not might not be for the company it might just be me and my taste buds because they're all messed up I ain't been feeling good but it's the, with it being three milligram nicotine, this one, you don't get the hit that I was wanting. I was wanting a little, I was hoping to get a little more of a more of a nicotine or a throat hit. Yeah, it's definitely good. Um, for me personally, um, it's a great liquid. Don't get me wrong. I would have liked it better if it was just a vanilla milkshake. I don't really like that vanilla bean spice at first. Like when you first hit it, like the inhale is like that vanilla bean spice, but nice. after after you exhale, it's like real creamy, even on your mouth after you hit it. Which is good. You can taste it, and I like that. But I wish it just didn't have that vanilla bean spice in the beginning. I'm going to lower mine down to 75, we'll see if you get that real strong vanilla bean, the spice taste on 75. Yeah, but the aftertaste is amazing. Oh, yeah. It's like <clears throat> creamy vanilla ice cream. Now I know this isn't going to make sense to a lot of people out there because it don't make sense to me either but I just noticed it. 
usually on a vape, and I've noticed when you do vape liquids, or you juice liquids, when you're vaping it, the higher the wattage, the hotter it is, and the ho the more throat more hit flavor. you get, the more throat hit you get. But I lowered this down to 75 watt, and I'm getting throat hit now more than I did with the 80. I'll try 75 and see if I have any difference. I mean, you don't taste the spice as much on 70 on a lower wattage. No, definitely the higher wattage, but that could be because of my taint. I have a coil in there that's the size of a bullet. <laughs> Even with mine. Um, I will say, though, you can tell they use real high-end ingredients. They're, and their labeling is a really cool. I like how it's a black bottle with black labels. I like it. I mean, uh, for me, the, the inhale is, like I said, the vanilla bean, like the vanilla, you know, the vanilla bean spice. But the exhale is a really good milkshake creaminess, and even after you get done blowing the puff out, or the vapor, or whatever you want to call it, you still taste the cream, and I like that. It just has a little bit too much spice, vanilla bean spice, on the inhale for me, but that's the only complaint I have about it. Other than that, it's really good. I don't, and yeah, and they're made in California. They don't got no burnt aftertaste, like a lot of sweet flavors. I will say something, though, and like she just said, this right here is a perfect example of how people's taste buds vary from person to person. Yeah. It's, uh, taste is very subjective. I was on 80 watts and I didn't get the throat hit or taste the, or I tasted a lot of the vanilla being, the bean spice. I lowered it down to 75 watts and I got less the, the spice taste, more of the milk, more of the vanilla taste, and more throat hit. Yeah, the, the creamy vanilla, the aftertaste is great. It's just the spice on the inhale initially just, it, I don't really like that about it, but it's really good, and your cloud production's great. I mean, it's not bad liquid. It's just not my at personal, all. It's um, just my personal opinion. Uh, I mean, <laughs> if I had to guess, honestly, cloud it's, production's great. Play eighty twenty. I imagine. Um, I'm looking, but I do not see that. Let me see if I find it on our website. And I will say this is Max VG. So um, it might be. Even. I'm not sure if their Max VG on this is. Um, yeah, if it, all their juices are Max VG or what. It might not even be. Twenty, right? It's not sure. It I don't say. I'm trying to see, but their labeling is so small. You gotta keep talking, honey, so we don't um, get in. It says eighty twenty online content of your e liquid. Yeah, so I think this is for the salt nick. That's for this one. I believe it's an eighty twenty. I could be wrong, yeah. but it says on the website uh, PGVG it says eighty twenty smoother oh, inhale. Hold on here. I got the thing right here. Flavors. So that could be what it is. I got it right here. Again, it's available in 60 ml bottles only. Um, I don't say anything about Nick Salts in this, though. I don't think you can get this one in Nick Salts. Um, but 0, 3, and 6 milligram. Um, I was looking at their flavor card here they sent us too, but it doesn't say. So we're not sure exactly what the PGVG is. It says max, so I'm guessing it's the max. I'm guessing it's either 80 20, the lowest is what I'm thinking. So it does give you good. Production. And I do want to throw something in there. We don't usually throw this in our videos, but I'm going to with this one. If you guys are watching across this video and you're new to vaping, okay, and you're not sure which milligram of e-juice to get, a good way, to, a good guidance or a good guiding chart is zero milligram is just for flavor. There's no nicotine at all in it. So if you're not, if you don't ever smoke and you never smoke, what you want to take on vaping, but you don't want it to nicotine, you just want pure good flavor. Get zero. Um, three milligram is for light smokers or those who are not craving a lot of nicotine. And six milligram, which is also known as 0.6%, is for light smokers who still want to fill up just a tad of nicotine. And then the 12, 18, and 24 milligrams. <laughs> um, again, though, do not use higher nicotine concentrates. Do not use, what do you call it, nick salt and sabone tanks. That's a big no-no. Um, but yeah... I really like this juice. Um, yeah, it's I pretty mean, it's, good. It's not something I would vape on 24-7, but... It's a great e-liquid. It's just the spice initially when you inhale it is a little much for me. I will say, though, it's... Um, maybe if you... I don't know if it works this way or not, but if your sugar's bottoming out and you got to vape and you get this, it might help a little bit because it is kind of sweet. I know there's no sugar in it, I don't believe, but... It's really good. Yeah, I have no complaints. The aftertaste in the, when you breathe it out, it tastes pretty good, though. Um, so. I, now, we have tried other um, e-juices out there that wasn't milkshake, but it was plain milk. 
like strawberry milk and stuff and they were horrible but yeah. not from this company no not from this company but from other just companies and they weren't that great but this is really good you don't really taste a whole lot of uh bitterness or nothing in it no it's not bitter very sweet but it does have that vanilla bean spice so do you get some vanilla beans flavor even on your 75 mm -hmm. no i don't but again if you want to get these this line or any of their other e-juice line be sure to check out apolloesigs.com um, and if you use coupon code um, at check off, check out, if you use coupon code CODY, that's CODY, capital C, capital O, capital D, capital Y, and that will also be in the description of this video. If you use that at the end of the, at, on your checkout, you will get 15% off of your order, which is really good because right now, this, this is for a 60 ml bottle online, it's going for $21.95. So if you use 15% off, that'll help you somewhat. And I still even even if you do not use the 15% off, yeah, it's still not bad that's deal. not a bad deal for the juice you're getting. Can they, the quality? Um, that code is only good though for e-juice and cannot be put with any other promotions. So again, I want to thank Apollo and Smoothie for sending out all the juices they sent to us for review, all the yeah. product, um, the promotional merchandise. We appreciate it. We want to thank you guys wholeheartedly. You did an excellent job with the e-juice. Yeah. And we're looking forward to trying out some more of your lines of V-Juice. So again, if you guys have tried this um, line or any other other lines and you like them, be sure to drop them in the comment and let us know. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, hit the bell notification, hit the subscribe button at the bottom of the video. And until next time, continue to stay safe, stay off the cigarettes, and continue to vape. Peace. Thanks for watching. Bye.